سلام من مجید هستم Our new lesson today is finally about conditional sentences in Persian. Today we're gonna learn only type 1 which is a possible or real condition. We are not talking about imaginary conditions. As you know a conditional sentence has two parts, two sentences. One is the condition which has the word if in English and in Persian it is age or standard agar. This is spoken age. And the other part is the result or consequence which is called main clause. As you see here Persian conditional sentences are really flexible. You can use many types of uh, structures here and here. But this is the most popular, most common structure that you can use, which is in the if clause, you have subjunctive. What is subjunctive? You know, it's the best structure, which is normally followed after a modal verb. We have had a lot of lessons about this. And the main clause is the present or future simple, which is the same in conversational Persian. So present simple, prefixes, stem and endings. So if we have something like this, if it rains, اگه بارون بیاد, بارون آمدن is the verb, and then we have this بیاد, we will stay home. خونه میمونیم. Simply present simple. I can use also here past simple. اگه بارون آمد, خونه میمونیم. It is possible. As I told you, It's very flexible. You can combine many of these structures together. Even we can have more structures here. But I'm just telling you today the most popular, the most common combinations that you can learn and use easily. So let's start our examples with this most common structure for conditional sentences in Persian. Age khub dars bekhuni. Age if خوب درس بخونی you study well امتحان رو قبول میشی you will pass the exam قبول شدن means to get accepted here it means to pass an exam اگه خوب درس بخونی امتحان رو قبول میشی اگه دیر بیای subjunctive if you come late ما بدون تو We without you جشن رو شروع می کنیم. We will start the party without you. اگه دیر بیای ما بدون تو جشن رو شروع می کنیم. اگه کارم زود تموم بشه Here we say if my work gets finished soon با هاتون میام. I will come with you. اگه کارم زود تموم بشه با هاتون میام. Here the verb is تموم شدن. To get finished. اگه سوپرمارکت باز باشه If the supermarket is open Here we have to be. To be the subjunctive is باش As you already know. And then we have supermarket, which is third person, باشه. حتماً گوشت میخریم. We will definitely buy meat. Present simple. اگه سوپرمارکت باز باشه, حتماً گوشت میخریم. If you'd like to support me, and if you'd like to have extra content, like listening, practice, exercises, quizzes, more lessons, vocabulary exercises, join my Patreon. Age ajale nakoni, if you don't hurry, so ajale kardan is the verb, it's negative, subjunctive, negative, here is nakon, then we have you, age ajale nakoni, اتوبوس رو از دست میدی simple present or simple future you will miss the bus اگه عجله نکنی اتوبوس رو از دست میدی 
اگه تو بیای if you come من هم میام I will also come اگه تو بیای من هم میام اگه وقت داشته باشم if I have time for have the subjunctive is داشته باش then we have I this ending اگه وقت داشته باشم if I have time بهت یاد میدم I will teach you اگه وقت داشته باشم بهت یاد میدم اگه سبزیجات کافی نخوری if you don't eat enough vegetables so subjunctive negative from the verb خوردن نخور then you نخوری خیلی زود very soon مریض میشی you will get sick اگه سبزیجات کافی نخوری خیلی زود مریض میشی اگه جلسه زود تموم بشه if the meeting gets finished soon if, it means also if the meeting ends early or soon میریم so here we have the verb شدن subjunctive ب and جلسه is third person اگه جلسه زود تموم بشه میریم we will go یه قهوه با هم a coffee together میخوریم we will have or we will drink اگه جلسه زود تموم بشه میریم یه قهوه با هم میخوریم now let's go to this structure so for this structure is the most common one and you can use it for most cases but imagine that in the main clause we have imperative then our best option is to use past simple or simple past here in the if clause and then imperative for the main clause example اگه زودتر رسیدی if you arrive earlier so arrive رسیدن simple past stem is رسید then you have you ending اگه زودتر رسیدی چای رو آماده کن prepare the tea here imperative imperative and here we have simple past tense اگه زودتر رسیدی چای رو آماده کن the difference between this and this is that in this case the whole condition is a little weaker than this this is this is more possible than this of course it's real it's possible but the possibility is less than here اگه مشکلی داشتی if you have any problems have past them داشت you داشتی اگه مشکلی داشتی بهم خبر بده imperative let me know اگه مشکلی داشتی بهم خبر بده اگه کسی زنگ خونه رو زد if someone زنگ خونه رو زد rings the doorbell so the verb is زدن for the third person past tense we use only past tense زد در رو وا نکن don't open the door negative imperative اگه کسی زنگ خونه رو زد در رو وا نکن اگه دیدیش if you see him or her اگه دید دیدن دید دیدی یو and this she is the object pronoun for him or her اگه دیدیش if you see him or her سلام من رو بهش برسون Say hello to him or her for me. Salam resundan means to take. Resundan is here to take my hello and just deliver it to that person. Age didish salam man ro 
بهش برسون اگه رفتی فروشگاه If you go to the store برای من یه بستنی بخر Buy me an ice cream اگه رفتی فروشگاه برای من یه بستنی بخر Now let's go to this Sometimes we have present simple here We can use present simple Simply present simple here And then other structures from the main clause But this is a common combination that I'm telling you Present simple and then imperative Example is here اگه گرونه If it is expensive Don't buy it نخر Or نخرش Buy it You might say Okay, we learned past simple and imperative and we can use it here. Yes, it's correct. You can use it. Age girun bud nakhar. But if we use this in this example, age girun bud nakhar, it means that you are telling this person uh, before he goes there to buy something. But if you use present simple, it's right now. It is like that you are talking on the phone and you say if It is right now. You are there. Expensive. Age gerune nachar. So when you use present simple, it's very, very present at the moment. It's the action is being done at the moment. The person is there at the moment. So age gerune nachar. If you are cold right now. اگه سردته if you're cold right now turn on the heater بخاری رو روشن کن so you can use again past simple here but then you are talking about future not right now اگه سردت شد سرد شدن means to get cold اگه سردت شد in one hour in two hours tomorrow in, at night or something بخاری رو روشن کن Turn on the heater. اگه اتوبوس نیست If there is no bus right at the moment The person is probably speaking on the phone تاکسی بگیر Take a taxi You can use past tense again here But as I told you it's about future Perhaps you're telling the person If you come to the main station And there is no bus or train Then Uh, take a taxi. اگه خسته ای if you are tired right now یک کم بخواب sleep a little اگه وقت نداری if you don't have time right now فراموشش کن just forget it اگه وقت نداری فراموشش کن نگاه کن اگه بارونه Look, if it rains or if it is rainy بارونه با خودت چتر ببر Take an umbrella with you As I told you, it is happening right now It is like you say If it is raining right now Take an umbrella with you نگاه کن اگه بارونه با خودت چتر ببر Here we have a combination of present simple And present simple or imperative structure. Let's see the example. Age dusish nadori. If you don't like it, it's present simple. You can return it. Mituni pasish bedi. So this is present simple. Mituni pasish bedi. We can use also imperative. Age dusish nadori pasish bedi. Just return it. This is the last example using subjunctive here. For this, I may have a special video with lots of popular examples so that you can learn all of them and use them in the future. But for the moment, we have an example here. If the music is loud, present simple, I will lower it. It's like you say, should I lower it? But it's not a question. You can also make it a question. Should I uh, lower it? 
but you can also use it as a normal sentence اگه صدای موزیک بلنده کمش کنم here we have another subjunctive 